Hi everyone, I am Dr. Atta, veterinary practitioner and health activist. Uh, it is May 29, 2020, and uh, after the cope of uh, this newly produced uh, human coronavirus COVID-19 uh, and the separation of uh, this uh, social distancing, uh, the people come out uh, to the road and to the urban areas. Uh, even though I am uh, outside in every uh, bit of uh, this uh, outbreak in the area, and uh, just now I come back to my private uh, garden, Kiwi Vine Garden, and uh, this phrases. Uh, I try to show, in this phrase, I try to show uh, some subjects of uh, my hobby, cultivation of a Kiwi Vine Garden. Yeah, uh, it is about that. And in this video, we try to show uh, some uh, erroneous ideas about fertilization of a Kiwi Vine Garden. Uh, and production of a uh, uh, mega uh, kiwi fruits, uh, keep it us in in the uh, repeating sequences. Thank you so much. Notice uh, this aunt who trying to go down from the shrubs. Can you find that? This and the honeybees like that. This is the actor of this signaling, uh, which lead to fertilization of this kiwi vine guard is uh, two elements which are very important in fertilization. We are made some another tricks for increasing the level of a fertilization. In the same time, uh, 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 excessive amount of flowers opened and on that time it is very important that uh, the cutting of a roughage in that area lead to accumulation and concentration of uh, insects around these flowers. As in the previous uh, items, I say something uh, about uh, the normal flowers. Uh, this is the uh, first flower and this is the uh, secondary flower. Uh, when the management of a nutrient element in this tree is normal, the second and first flower open at the same time, or very, very uh, small times, a small lapse. Uh, it is very important that a kiwi vine garden can, can manage this. And uh, as we know in the animals, the terms of hormones and the term of signaling of hormones, trees have a special hormones and special uh, connective uh, materials which can induce hormones. Uh, even excessive or uh, low level of uh, some nitrous elements, especially in the hibernated time uh, of trees uh, in the December and October, can lead to an uh, aggressive uh, amount of a uh, fused kiwi uh, ovum uh, or, agri or a small amount of uh, flowers in that area. Um, uh, we think uh, this is normal and we are waiting uh, for uh, fertilizing of uh, that in uh, a couple of uh, uh, days consequently. In this time, uh, normal hydration of a uh, uh, kiwi vine guard is very important as you should find. Uh, this is completely wet and we try uh, to make uh, the flowers attractive for the honeybees. Most of the researchers and most of the workers who practice in the kiwi vine guard believe that the summer pruning of the shrubs, especially the f fruit filled shrubs, uh, can produce accumulation of oxygen in the end of a uh, shrub and uh, helping the elongation uh, of these fruits. Uh, we try to find that uh, because uh, in, in this year we are faced with series of uh, agricultures uh, and series of uh, workers who believe that uh, the primary pr pruning of uh, these shrubs is very important. In this uh, video we try to show that uh, the pruning of a tree is like that, which down approximately 20 uh, days uh, before uh, produce the fruits, fertilized fruits, which are not very, which, which are not different from that 
like that, which are not pruned. And uh, in this video, we try to show that uh, some uh, mistakes about uh, practitioners who believe that the early pruning of the shrubs can help to elongation of a fruit. Approximately in that time that the process of fertilization are uh, so on, it is not visible and is not preferable. Thank you so much. I am Dr. Attar. Bye.